Hello and welcome to the CBF Tech today with me, your host Chris. And today we're learning how to make strawberry and banana smoothies. So I prepared all my fruit in advance. So I have cut the strawberries and I have peeled the banana and cut that into small pieces. So we have our liquidizer here and we also have some apple juice. Make sure you have washed your hands before you start. And then when you've all got this prepared, we are going to start by placing the strawberries and bananas in the liquidizer. So let's do that now. Make sure you've washed your fruits, as I said. And the shaft of the blade as you place your fruits into the liquidizer. So I've placed my strawberries in first. And next we're going to put in the bananas. So I've cut them into the same kind of size chunks as the strawberries. So that's the last one in there. So we can now put that plate down there. And we need to add some apple juice. So we're going to open up the apple juice which I've prepared. And let's pour some in. And that's enough there. And if you spill some, like I spilled a bit, you can just get a towel or some kitchen roll like I've got and just wipe that up there. This is not a problem, it won't ruin your smoothie, don't worry about that. So there we go, that's clean. So we added our apple juice and you've got to remember that you can add more if it needs. Uh, so you don't really know how much you need straight away but you can add more later in the process. So we're going to start by using the one setting. And So that looks about done. Uh, we may need to add some more apple juice, but I think ours is okay. But if you need to at home, you can add some more. So this should serve one cup. So we're just going to take this off. And we have a cup ready. So we remove the lid. And we're going to pour this into a glass. And you can get a straw. While I was away, I just got the straw for the smoothie. And we're going to have a quick taste. Very nice. So this was how to make a strawberry and banana smoothie. And this is the finished product. It tastes very nice. And you can make one of these at home using the instructions below in the description. Um, please don't forget to like this video, subscribe and comment. So thank you for watching and I was Chris and this is the CBF Tech.